Hi. I am talking to no one. Oh, there we go. Hello, everybody. Um... Hey. <laughs> Just wanted to say hello. Hadn't live-streamed in a while, and, uh... You guys are very interesting people. And I thought we could have interesting conversations. And talk to you on this fine wait what day is it today chops what day is it today <laughs> oh my goodness wait what today's Tuesday on this fine Tuesday afternoon are you on holiday I wish just kidding I actually really love my work so I'm happy I'm not on holiday I'm working but I graduated school so I don't do that You're working on homework Ooh, what are you studying? How you doing? I'm good. I'm, uh, very excited for this next project that I'm working on. Uh, and I can't tell you guys. It's top secret. But I will tell you at some point. You guys will hear about it. But until then, mom's the word. I love you, dear. Oh, I love you. <laughs> gang, 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 gang. <laughs> mm. What time is it there? That is a great question. I don't know. <laughs> what was your favorite school year? Ooh. Out of high school, probably... Probably 11th grade, because it was the hardest. Junior year, I think, is the hardest year, in my opinion. And I really like that. Jade, it's your boy Ronan. Aww. Jewish boy. Ronan. Hello. I miss you so much. We gotta we gotta actually kick it. We always say that we're gonna kick it and we never do. And it's really sad. So we gotta go look at cars or something. Where are you? I am on a couch in a yard <laughs> in Los Angeles, California. <laughs> Um, <laughs> I miss you too, ex Fremer. How you doing? How's life? Tell me about it. Ooh, San Antonio, Texas. That's uh, that's pretty cool. I have a lot of family in San Antonio, so I like it over there. You don't see my account anymore. I just haven't been on Instagram recently, to be perfectly honest. Keep tagging me, and I will I will like it. I will look at it. Who is your boyfriend? <laughs> His name is Finn Dayton. He's amazing. What age am I? I am 17, but I turn 18 in a couple months. And I'm very excited <laughs> for that. <laughs> my favorite color my favorite color I usually say red but I've been really enjoying green recently maybe there's going to be a change occurring I don't know if I want to put like a definitive answer there because I really do enjoy red and green I don't know you look 14 you do don't I I hope you'll be so happy as you deserve. Thanks. <laughs> right back at you. You deserve to be as happy as you possibly can be. Favorite Marvel movie? Ooh. Uh, that's a great question. I actually really loved Infinity Wars, which was surprising for me, but I thought that that was amazing, and the fact that there were so many characters and so many storylines and they didn't it wasn't diluted you know they they represented each superhero so well I don't know how they did it but I thought it was amazing um, favorite superhero is actually not a Marvel superhero I really really love Batman I know he's a classic but he's amazing Actually, you're happy. 
I am happy. <laughs> Hello. I'm from danger. Fancy. Do you like K-pop? It's so good, dude. I do like K-pop. I haven't listened to enough of it, but I quite enjoy what I've heard. Hi, Jade. Who's your favorite person out of School of Rock? <laughs> I love all of them, and I know that's not the answer people want to hear, but I, we grew up together, and I, it was a very uh, unique experience to grow up with people in that way, and I think that um, all of them are very close to my heart. What time is it? I don't know. I feel like I'd have, I'd have to exit this live stream to know what time it is, and I want to continue to talk to you guys, so. Do you, do you like Ariana Grande? I don't know what that means, but if you're trying to ask if I like Ariana Grande, I do. I have a lot of respect for her. I think she's so talented. I miss Chloe. <laughs> Favorite book? <gasps> this is a great question. On the Road by Jack Kerouac. I want to create and I want to travel the world. And I feel like I see the world. Um in a brighter way than before when I read that. So I highly recommend that book. Um, fashion icon. I would say... <sighs> fashion icon. I want to say Audrey Hepburn. I think she's very classic. I love... I love her. And I also really love Twiggy. I think Twiggy is... <laughs> fly in my face. It's amazing. Um... Where would I travel to? Top of the list right now is Greece. And then Italy and France and New Zealand. And Ireland. And I also really want to go to Iceland, actually. I think that would be very interesting. Thank you. Mr. Jake Hogan! Oh, the man himself. I miss you very much. I hope you're doing well. You're the best actress, and so is everyone else. <laughs> Thanks. On behalf of me and everyone else, we say thank you. Advice to someone who wants to sing. Sing loud and sing it proud. Didn't mean to rhyme there, but it makes it more uh, pungent and powerful. No, people who want to sing, I think, um, embrace the quirks of your own voice. And I always love it when people kind of embrace their own sound as opposed to try and sound as opposed to trying to sound like someone else um, and sing passionately and you know have fun <laughs> I'm from Dublin Ireland it is really nice I really want to go to Dublin so badly I want to be where you are hi Jade your, your character at rock school is my favorite oh I'm glad I love that Favorite movie? Harold and Maude, I would say, at the moment. And Kill Bill. Do I like Demi Lovato? Um, I do. Are you going to work in music projects again? I am, actually. Uh, it's been a while since I've done stuff, but I actually just started writing again and getting things in the works, so you should have some... I'll be releasing things, and I'll release it soon, so you guys will be able to hear what I sound like. <laughs> It'll be very fun. My favorite animal is chops, specifically. Not dogs, but chops. <laughs> am I writing? I am writing quite a bit. Quite a bit. Um... Yeah. <laughs> I'll tell you more when I'm not on a live stream. <laughs> but yes. Ocean Eyes, like this music. I do love Billie Eilish, yes. I really need you to... I really need you to hear you sing with Jada again. I really need to hear myself sing with Jada again, too. I think Jada and I have similar voices, but they're also quite different. And I think we complement each other. 
I have a puppy that we adopted recently, and she's like the cutest thing ever. Oh, congratulations. Do I like Green Day? I do. Quite a bit. Good. <laughs> yes. You look so great together. Thank you. That's a different language that I do not know. Um, guys, I can't wait to tell you about everything. And I can't tell you yet, which is so sad. But it's very exciting. Dream vacation. Going somewhere, traveling somewhere that has a lot of history and being where the locals are, as opposed to just where the tourists go, and eating really good food, and being with really, really amazing people that I love, and um, living as, as rich as possible, and as full of life as possible. <laughs> Say something in Spanish. Hola. <laughs> Do you like BB Rexa? Don't know that. Am I done with school? I am. I graduated high school. Um, and TV projects, are you working in some? It's a film. I can say that. It's a new film coming out that I start filming in a couple weeks. Do I like India? Ooh, I would love to go to India. Yes, please. Please, please, please. <laughs> There's very little places in the world that I don't want to go and visit um there's so many beautiful cultures and uh, people and traditions in so many different areas of the world you know i want to experience all of it you should come to argentina it's full of beautiful places i would love to go to argentina my best friend's family is in argentina and i i'm constantly telling her that i want to go there you have a best friend. <laughs> yeah, I do. Um, her name is Fiona Palomo, and you should follow her because she's an amazing musician, artist, and actress, and uh, she's my favorite person, and Isabella Akers, and Sharani Golan, and other beautiful people, and uh, Finn Dayton. These are my, these are my best friends. Yes, Fiona. I know. She's iconic. You guys really should follow her. She's I actually don't really call her a best friend anymore. I call her my sister because we are sisters, essentially. Um, she really is one of my fa favorite, favorite individuals on this planet. I do follow Fiona. Who do you think I am? Aw, <laughs> oh, Jade Petty John, Argentina. I like you a lot. <laughs> What? I should be your favorite person. X Fremer, you are my favorite person as well. I have a lot of favorite people. <laughs> Ciao. Namaste from India. I still geek out over the fact that there's so many people. There was someone from Dublin, there's someone from Argentina, from India. It's really cool. What was your favorite subject in school? History, without a doubt. I think it's so important to um, understand history and to be able to see the outpoints and to see it repeating itself currently and to be able to stop it and to know what would happen if you repeated certain things. Um, so I think that's very important. And math also is very important, except I wasn't. I like it now that I'm done with it. <laughs> I do like Tamika. She's a funny character. Um, do you speak Spanish? I don't. Not really. I'm learning. I want to learn. Where am I from? I am from... Uh, I'm from Los Angeles, California. Do you believe in luck? You know, 
I do and I don't. I don't think, I think that some people can be lucky, but I don't think that, I think that hard work um, is so much more important than luck and way more common. And I think that if you work hard at something and you push through all of those barriers and you continue to do what you want to do and you really put in the work and you commit, that you can do anything, you know, and luck relying on someone else or something else to give it to you or to hand it to you and I think that um, I think that people are very very powerful in their own right and being independent and being like the cause of something I think I think there's a lot that can come from that and there's a lot of power in that so I like to embrace that um, the power of creating your own fate and your own luck You're my I don't know what that means, to be perfectly honest with you. Is it some cool young hip thing like like the whip? Oh, that was terrible. Uh, <laughs> I need to catch up on the, the times. I should be washing the dishes and my actual mom, not you, is going to kill me. But that's okay, your life is more interesting. Oh. Well, um, hi mom. Hey kiddo. You I'm should. Off to the races. Alright, I will see you very soon. Okay, cool. I love, love you. Ya. Love you too. Um, doing the dishes are actually really fun and I think you should. Um, if you do both, that'd be really cool. Because I also like talking to you. But My dream house and location. It's in L.A., honestly. Um, being in L.A. and and uh, living in a house that's really warm and comforting and um, very artsy and has a lot of art in it everywhere and really nice backyard so I could be outside. I'm going to be an actor. Heck yeah, you are. Do it. Oh, you and your mom are so cute. We are so cute. She is. She's also one of my best friends. Um, I love her so much. Favorite movie is Harold and Maude and Kill Bill. I also love Casablanca. I'm doing both. I'm like a pro. I had a feeling. I had a feeling you were a pro. Favorite food? Sushi. But it's like, I, I'm at a next level with sushi. I, I always say that sushi is my favorite food, but Finn has been taking me to these very authentic Japanese restaurants that have authentic sushi, and it's very uh, not American, and there's like no California rolls on the on the menu. It's, it's real, and it's amazing. So I would have to say sushi. And I also, as Californian as this sounds, I really love salad. I really enjoy it. Um, a really good crisp salad. Oof, so good. You need to test dolce de leche. <gasps> dolce de leche is one of my favorite desserts. Oh my god, I love dolce de leche. Like my favorite ice cream by far is dolce de leche. When did you meet Finn for the first time? I met Finn for the first time in early July. No. Before that, June. I met him in June, and we started dating in July. Um, how are you, Angel? I'm really good. Will School of Rock continue? No, School of Rock has reached its end, and, um, yeah. I think it went for a really good amount of time, you know. And I think that, uh, I think it's good. We like Finn a lot. <laughs> I'm glad you like him. I, uh, I quite love the dude. He's a good one. You're so beautiful. Thanks. <laughs> what like more of School of Rock? What's like more School of Rock? I don't know. 
but not like that I like for you, OMG. That sounded bad. <laughs> Which film are you starting next? I can't tell you, unfortunately. But Destroyer is a film I did um, with Nicole Kidman, which is really cool and really the opposite of School of Rock. My character is as opposite as opposite could be. And uh, that'll be coming out in theaters Christmas Day. So you guys should definitely watch it. Just know, for you younger ones, that it is pretty intense. So maybe wait till you're older to watch it if you're under certain age. I don't know if it, I think it. I think it's rated R. I don't see how it couldn't. I don't know. Maybe it's not. But I have a really good feeling it's rated R. So sounds like you're a bad girl in that movie. I am very rebellious. And a lot of other things. <laughs> My best friend is crushing on you. Yay. <laughs> have I watched my movie, my movie, McKenna, lately? I have not. I don't really watch mm, my projects after I've finished them. I watched them, like, once. I watched, I watched McKenna, like, three times, I think, because there were, like, screenings and things like that. But I was so young. You know? It's weird to look at myself at that age. Favorite actress? <sighs> Lauren Bacall and Emma Stone and Saoirse Ronan and Viola Davis. And Meryl Streep. Because that's everyone's favorite actress. Um, can we DM each other? I really don't go on my DMs, guys. I'm so sorry. Favorite TV show? The Office and Handmaid's Tale. <laughs> Those could not be more different. You're a very good actress. Thank you. Hello. Eyes. What's up with your YouTube channel? Oh, my YouTube channel is so old. I don't recommend looking at anything that's there because it's so old. Uh, I don't think I've posted in like two or three years. Um, I actually am thinking of putting out music on my YouTube channel, like covers and maybe originals, who knows, um, soon. Well, what, what, what else would you guys want to see if I, if I started do, doing more YouTube things? Would you guys want to see, like, challenges, or, I don't know if, I don't think I'm a vlogger, I don't think I could do that. I mean, I could, I don't know, if that's something you guys really want to see, maybe, but. Would you ever do a collab with a saxophonist? Heck yeah, I would. Do you know any? You could do vlogs. Are you friends with Annie LeBlanc? I've never met her. I think, I don't know why people think that I uh, know her, but. And challenges with Finn and Fiona. <laughs> that would be amazing. Um, yeah, we could do, we could do challenges like that. Who knows me better, boyfriend versus sister? Oh! <laughs> that would be amazing. I, sh I need to talk to them about that. I have a feeling... I mean, Fiona's got the advantage in the sense that I've known her since I was two. But, but then again, Finn has a really wickedly amazing memory and knows, remembers everything, so... Favorite actor. Favorite actor is Gary Oldman. You like religions? I love religions. I think, um, I respect all, all faith. And I think that it does really beautiful things for the individual. If it makes you feel more connected to something bigger than yourself, then that's, that's a beautiful thing. I should be your manager, OMG. <laughs> I think you should. My favorite music is music that makes me feel something, and that could be in any genre. I've been listening to a lot of J. Cole recently, and a lot of Kendrick Lamar, and they're amazing. And I, but I also really love um, Ella Fitzgerald and Etta James, and I love Prince, and I love Billie Eilish, so just anything, any kind of music that makes me feel something. Um...
What's your favorite TV show? Again, Handmaid's Tale in the Office. And The Night Of, actually. And... Yeah, those are my favorites. <laughs> I also really like Big Little Lies. What Harry Potter house are you in? Uh, I want to say Gryffindor, but I always get Slytherin. I don't know if that's a bad thing. Um, there's this band I love. Their name is Sleeping at Last. I love Sleeping at Last, and they have beautiful covers and original songs. 10 10 would recommend. Yeah, Sleeping at Last has a song called Turning Pages that I really like, and then they do a cover of Chasing Cars that makes me cry. Please notice me. You are noticed, Chanel. Hmm. FKU. Aw, let's keep it nice, huh? The real question here is, does Kiki love Drake? That's the question of the hour, of the year. I mean, does she? I don't know. Are you Peterhead? What does that mean? Chasing Cars is my favorite cover of Sleeping Alas. It makes me cry too. I know, it's so emotional, it's so good. That song in general is so... Ugh, when I'm driving, I'll, I'll listen to that song and I'll just have like, tears in my eyes and the windows will be rolled down and get very emotional like, like someone's filming me like it's a music video or something that's overly emotional but no one's there. No one's watching me. <laughs> um... All right, I'm gonna answer like one more question, and then I'm gonna I'm gonna hit it. So, make it a good one, please. Um... <laughs> These are questions. I want a cheeseburger and fries. <laughs> Me too. What's life? Ooh, deep. Do you love me? See Grey's Anatomy? These are three, and I'm going to answer all of them. Uh, I haven't seen Grey's Anatomy. Um, do, you, do I love you? Yes. What is life? Life is trying to understand others and listening to others and feeling connected to people and animals and life and love. And, yeah and making art and creating things and helping out your fellow man. That's life. That's a good life right there. Uh, that's really cool. I'm going to end on that because that's kind of cool and deep and exciting. So I love all of you immensely, and I hope you have an amazing week. And I will probably be posting more because I need to, and I haven't. Um, yeah. <laughs> all right. Bye, guys.